My mission was to make Oak Glen Petting Zoo a destination. What they needed was a star animal. The plan? To create a hero pig by staging a viral video in which he rescues a baby goat from drowning. Oh, okay. So I think if you had a video like that, people would come from places as foreign as Japan and even more foreign like China just to see your hero pick. That would be great. The first step was picking our animals. Vince would be our hero pig and Gangster the goat would be our victim. The zoo had a large trout pond, so this would be the setting for our rescue. But when I brought Vince near the water, I realized he was an incredible coward. Okay, 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 okay. So we hired some animal handlers to bring in a professional movie pig that looked identical to Vince. The question now was, how do we get a pig to rescue a goat on camera? Answer, you can't. So I decided to have two scuba divers secretly submerged beneath the animals, guiding the pig towards the goat to make it look like a real rescue. During the first couple attempts, the pig kept slipping out of the diver's hands. So we decided to build an underwater track out of PVC to guide the pig like a bowling ball going down a bumper lane. This worked a lot better, and I was hopeful it would fool the internet audience into believing this video was real. But as the amount of people involved began to grow, including animal trainers, stuntmen, and humane society reps, I started to get worried. After all, word couldn't get out that this was fake, or it would be a disastrous scandal for Oak Glen. So I asked everyone on set to sign non-disclosure agreements, stating that they swore not to tell anyone the rescue was fake, or else they would face the death penalty. Even though my lawyer said the death penalty clause was not enforceable, I still wanted to leave it in there so people knew how serious I was. And after several failed attempts, we finally got the rescue on tape. We had our video, and it was great. But now, we needed a convincing backstory. If this goes viral, the press will want to know who filmed this video. It couldn't be me with my background in television. People would smell a hoax from a mile away. But there was one person no one would ever suspect. Santa Claus. In order to distance myself from the pig rescuing goat video, I got James to agree to say that he was the one who shot it. So for believability, I needed to record audio of James to make it sound like he was there on the day it was filmed. Goat in the water, goat in the water, goat in the water, yeah. goat in the water. Now, I needed to be sure that Terry was with the program. So when the media comes a knocking, mm -hmm. here's what you say okay. verbatim. Okay. I sometimes take the animals out to the pond. That day, I left to go get my lipstick from the office. That's when the goat must have slipped in. I never saw the rescue. However, a good Samaritan showed me the video. I never got his name or his gender. Now repeat. Give me a minute. I sometimes. <sighs> I sometimes take the animals out to the pond. Here, I did write it down for you. Thank you. With Terry's script to memorize, the hero pig story was becoming more concrete. When the goat slipped in, okay. But then I realized I had one more mouth to shut. While we were filming the rescue, one of the scuba divers, Alex, was telling me some pretty personal stuff about actors he's worked with in the past. Jennifer Aniston, Ben Stiller. Ben's pretty bold. He had to do some kind of nude water stuff over in Hawaii. For Along Came Polly, I did that movie with him. Alex was clearly a liability, and I couldn't have him spilling details about our video on his next job. So I asked him to meet me at the Pico subway station to have a little reminder chat. Thanks for meeting me here. How's it going? No worries. Good. Good. Oh, you're a bit tense. So, uh, here, yeah, come well, stand, you know, stand right here. <laughs> yeah, what, what? So how you been? Good. Um, I just wanted to ask you, remember that Pig Rescues Goat video we made? Yeah. yeah. You haven't been talking to anyone about that or anything, have you? Mm, you look like you're trying to like threaten me. What? You look like you're... No, you're no, not at all. Your just shoulders were sore. That's why I was doing it. Come on. Just because I'd be very very upset yeah. if you told someone about it. You? All right, like, all right, okay, okay. yes, I'm sorry. I know, I'm sorry, yes, I, I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, but please don't tell anyone, okay? Okay, thank no you. Worries. Okay. My paranoia was getting the best of me. The video hadn't even been uploaded, and I was already getting worried about people revealing the secret. Plus, watching the video again, I started to doubt that this would fool anyone. Goat in the water. All I could do at this point was upload the video and let the public decide. Goat in the water. <laughs> 